something you'll need to know is how to tell what this means. Okay, this the first two digits mean hundredth of a second. So that's not even one second. This third and fourth digit from right to left means seconds. The five and six digit from right to left means minutes. And the seven and eight digit from right to left means hours. We got hundredth of a second, seconds, minutes, and hours. And it's the same with the timeline below. Whenever you zoom in, as much as you can go, we see hundredth of a second, seconds, minutes, and the hour section. Hello, now we are going to fix a file that's got audio running out of sync, but the audio comes late. I'll show you an example of what I mean. I dragged it into Movie Micro in 2.6. Here is a preview of the file that we are going to fix. This is a video on how to make the voice match if it's out of sync. See the audio one's late. So in this case, I made sure I can see the audio space here. You know. I right click the file, copy it, paste it in the audio section, drag it even with the file above. I mute the original video file. I push play and find the beginning of the audio. I wait till it starts talking. Now, so I'm on previous frame one, two, three, so that I can get before the audio starts. Left click the cut button. Delete the first half. That's just blank. No audio whatsoever. So I can work on that and not this second half. So I click play and watch when the mouse starts to move. This is the video. Now, okay, now I zoom in. The mouse started to move at 1.67 seconds. So I drag the audio file to 1.67 seconds. Left click before it so I can test it out. And the audio is still running a little bit late, so I'm going to drag it a little bit more to the left. Test it out again. This is a video on how to make the voice match if it's out of sync. Okay, it looks like I did it. So now I will save the file.
choose a power location. And now to test that file out. That walk just fine. Hello, tonight we will be taking the file that is out of sync and lining up the audio with the mouth. Here is the file. This is a video on how to make the voice match if it's out of sync. See, it's out of sync horribly. First, we drag it into a Windows Movie Maker 2.6. Then we drag it into the video timeline. Now we copy the file. We then paste it in the audio or slash music section. Okay, after we do that, we mute the main video clip. Now we zoom in on it. Press play. This is a video on how to. In this case, the audio starts right here. So we watch the mouth and see when it starts to move. This is a video on how to. For around one point sixty seconds. So we drag this to around 1.60 seconds. This is a video on how to make the voice match if it's out of scene. And it looks like it's almost right but not quite. So I'm going to drag it to the left just a little bit. This is a video on how to make the voice match if it's out of sync. That seems correct. Push play one more time to test it out. This is a video on how to make the voice match if it's out of sync. Okay, it looks like we got it done. I am going to save the phone. To any place on our shoes. And that's it, we're done.